Hello everyone, my name is John Terrell. I'm an application engineer with QTE Manufacturing Solutions and today I'm excited to present to you the second installment of our 10-part series on what's new in Master Cam 2024. Today I'm going to be talking about maximum engagement in our dynamic tool paths. Maximize engagement is an option inside of our dynamic mill, face, and dynamic OptiRough tool paths in Master Cam. The maximize engagement option is located in our cut parameters of those three roughing tool paths. With the engagement on, as you can see in this tool path on the right compared to the one on the left, the motion is much better than the one on the left just by looking at it but I want to take a deep dive in and show you exactly what this entails so let's look at it if I turn on the toolpath with engagement off and I want to look at where we start onto the where we start onto the flange here with the tool our step over is very light compared to with the engagement on you can already see that the toolpath is way on over there as you can see here what does that do that gets that step over into that part a lot quicker than it did with engagement off. Let's take a look at this thin wall on this flange with engagement off and let's run it through the back plot. You can see again when we come around that our step over it kind of follows from the beginning and it doesn't get over as far as what we would like. If I turn on with engagement on let's take a look at this now and our thin wall is pretty much covered when it comes around as you can see there and last let's turn it back with the engagement off and let's look at the island cleanup around these bolt holes in this flange if I back plot that you can see that the toolpath comes around with the step over still not totally to the percentage of the diameter tool that we set so it has to come around and then it'll come around again and then what it does it kind of jumps around and there now it can actually leave a little sliver or low island of stock there so with engagement turned on we'll back plot it you get a whole different scenario here the step overs there and the consistency of the step overs there and it doesn't do four or five passes it does a, a, about three to clean that island up on that bolt hole so what does maximize engagement bring to the table as far as uh, the tool pass concerned it produces a nominal chip versus the slivers that we sometimes get with our dynamic tool paths. Additionally, it moves the tool toward the enter step over as quickly as possible. It doesn't keep it hanging out and working its way in at a, at, a, at a slower pace. Basically, with that happening, we extend our tool life, we reduce vibration in the tool, and we disperse the heat because the chips are more consistent, and we reduce the overall machine wear. And on top of that, the code is smaller because the file, the toolpath file size is uh, smaller with engagement on. This is a, a very good en enhancement in 2024 Mastercam that I think is going to be a game changer. And we've been getting a lot of great feedback from our customers that are actually using this option. And I hope you can use it in your situation as well. I hope you enjoyed the video and have a good day.